if you don't got a pair of these, I don't know what you're doing. It's a staple. It's a staple, bro. Where your shoes at? I got bored. It's a hurricane now. So it's a sneak video at this point. Come on. So hopping in this, we're gonna do a little top 15. Best shoes and I got a couple, just a couple shoes. Roll to be roll. You know how we roll. Coming at you at number 15, we have the original Crazy BYWX Pharrell collab, black and white pairs. I'm connecting them because I wear them together. Now, retail price, these came in at about 550. At number 14, we have Air Force 2008 LVAs. Now, there was three pairs that came with these. I got the green joints because who don't like green? Hello. I like green. It's icy without, without the lights, you know what I'm saying? It's not major though. Little metallic overlay, not major. Peak decrease, I've had these for four years, but guess what, they still icy, y'all. Coming in at 13, we have another staple, but this this more like, it might well be a hood staple, my boy. This is a certified hood classic. These are re-release, and the story behind these is, I had lost four rappers to get these, right? But then I came in the Hibis, like right after they open, right? And I took somebody's 11s. Now I wear 11 and a half, and these are 11s, but these are re-released the 4.5 for 2018. No major. Hood staple, my boy. Hood staple. This is a certified hood classic. Coming in at number 12. Now me, I'm a retro 18, so like I may, I may be a little bit biased. These, these ain't the hardest, not these. But boy, they near and dear to my heart, boy. I'm talking retro late three piece, boy. No major, no crazy, but come on, boy. Icy, icy bottoms, boy. Icy bottoms, and I've worn these everywhere. Number eleven, we have my first pair of new retros. I had my my first pair of original retros with some used retro tint NYCs, which I got off of eBay for like 120 bucks. I ain't even gonna cap to you. There was a whole scratch at the toe, but it was beat up. They were bottom, but. For number 11, we got the Air Jordan 12. Boy, those, no major. It's like a nice little maroon purple colorway, depending on the lighting you get them in. I originally got these just to hoop for home games back when I played at Northview. Not major, they slight. Now number 10 is where we, oh, we get the heat a little bit, you know what I'm saying? Solar pack for our NMDs. Wow. Oh, one to three right here. I got the pink joints and the blue laces because, you know what I'm saying? Go major, put the white laces in this one. Little contrast, little drip, little, little something major. Yeah, little something major. Not a little something slight, boy, little something major, man. These probably the comfiest shoes I got besides the one that's coming up soon, you know what I'm saying? I'll let you know though. And number nine, we have something that cost me a lot of money. Not price-wise, heart-wise. The Fuse Blue Sixes, which were originally gonna be a friends and family release. Uh, Jimmy Butler colorway, whenever you played on the Timberwolves. These go crazy. 2018, and they still icy. At number eight, we easily, easily have the best summer shoes of all time. You probably seen them in Space Jam. You probably seen them on Mikey. But ain't nobody wear them like me. Yes, so, real boy, stop playing. Nike Air Atmos Ones. Come on now, different laces. You get a couple different color laces. You get some pink joints, which originally came with them like this. And then you get some neon ones and some orange ones. Me, put the neon in, put the orange ones in. They went crazy, boy. Easily the best summer shoes of all time. Fat air bubble, comfy boy. You can't go wrong with them. You can't go wrong with them. They slide. Pressure. And number seven, we have my biggest regret of all time. We have the Easy 500 Sauce. Now, the reason I say this is my biggest regret is I paid 400 for these. 
Once again, I paid for them afterwards. I got them off of like stadium goods. The issue with these is you can't match them with anything. I've seen folks wear full yellow fits with them. Don't know why at all. Full black fits, also don't know why. I mean, I guess you you there there you have no choice, but the bottom comes from an old pair of Kobe's back whenever he was an Adidas athlete. And they're just like, you know what? Throw it on the bottom of these. And they comfortable. They comfortable, they look good. You have a little reflective light bar, light bar, lining around it. It's not major. Now at number six, we have another, why did I buy these? Why? Air Jordan 9 Mangoes. Now, the way they look on here right now, it look like three different colors in person. They also look like three different colors. Whenever I bought them, I thought that was black. What am I supposed to wear with these? What am I supposed to wear with these? I mean, I know a lot of things I could wear with these, but like, I'm not trying to look like a traffic cone either. Like, that's why at this point, I'm dropping my own clothes at this point. Merch on the way. Yeah. Now, before we get to the top five, I just want to bring in some honorable mentions. Honorable mentions because I have probably like a hundred shoes. I'm gonna keep it about you. I think I think I'm I'm either at triple digits or I'm almost at triple digits. Keep in mind I ain't bought shoes since spring break of like 2019. I got all my shoes within a year and a half. Baby. My first honorable mention. Bitch, I got the motherfucking lemon pepper stuff. After that, you get the new Look at this dude. <laughs> that I bought from Quay. For the final honorable mention. Oh. He oh. needs some milk. This is just a reminder. It's free to subscribe. Three ninety nine. What is you doing, baby? These dropped in 2017 as a little three pack. City NYCs, but these the New York joints. These are New York joints, the gray ones. They dropped some Atlanta ones that were white, green, and gold. And then they dropped some Chicago ones, which are mainly red with black lining. But these right here are a sleeper. Sleeper. If you don't know, they normally say air on them. These are a sleeper, though. You can never go wrong with a solid gray shoe. Never go wrong. Like I said, these dropped in 2017, and they still hard. Like, up tempos haven't gotten better since these. These are the peak of up tempos. I don't care. Number four, we have the most comfortable pair of shoes God has ever given me, aka Virgil Abloh. Another sleeper, off-white raffle races. Now these are <laughs> they a women's shoe, but they so motherfucking comfortable though. Them spikes on it, boy. Listen, listen. It don't get more like <laughs> cushion is at its prime, like. Come on, what is you doing if you don't got these? Number three, another sleeper that's not so much slept on as much as people just couldn't get them. Gray five alternates 2020. These go stupid. Any color rush shoe, I'm going bonkers for going stupid, crazy, dumb. Ah, go stupid. Ah! Like I'm going stupid. How do you beat that? How? I'll show you how. And number two, and that's the fearless ones. Now. This isn't so much a sleeper as much as people just don't know how to wear them. They come with four colors of laces. Black, as you've seen. White. Red. And blue. If I see any of y'all out there with any laces other than the black, I'm putting that fire on your Yeah. I'm gonna put that fire on your dumb I don't ever want to see that shit. I don't ever want to see that I seen Jitty at the mall. He lucky I, I, and I'm Cordoba Sosa. I'm always strapped at the mall, but you gonna play with me one more time. And I swear to God, I swear to God, I'm to the number one. Number one, we have the most heavenly shoe of all time. I don't care what anybody says. Greatest shoe of all time. We released all time. Back whenever I used to rap, I was making lyrics about these. Couldn't afford the mock waist. I got the water whipping. Like, come on. Jordan 8 Aquas, the 2015 release. I paid a cool four for these. Before tax, before shipping. More than what I paid for these. I refuse to pay more than $500 for a pair of shoes. 
I almost did it, boy. Cause like you can't beat these. You can't beat these. These from 2015 and look, they icy, flawless. Barely any dust on them, and it's only because I just put them. I just put my hands on them. They go crazy, major. Like I said, it's a hurricane outside. I'm bored. Nah, like I said, merch drop, and if y'all want that, come get at me. Any video ideas, come get at me. Just drop them in the comments. Y'all don't comment it, I'm telling you, I got a comment, man. Y'all got a comment. I'm telling you, new content on the way. And guess what? I seen that 12K on that money spread. Yeah, post a video about it on TikTok right there. Go get that. You gotta follow my TikTok, boy. We only going up from here. Ooh, I see the 148. As of right now, I have 148. I'm, I'm going to make that 100 subscriber video, I promise you. But instead of it being the, um, instead of it being the Menace to Society video, it's going to be something else. That's, 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 that takes a lot of production. <laughs> I completely underestimated how much I was going to have to do to do that Menace video to what I wanted it to be, how I wanted it to be, and all of that. But without further ado, like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you for watching the video, boy. And girls, as I found out. I didn't know that. Cool. I appreciate all that. Yes, sir. Since you're still here, this the setup I'm working with. This the setup I'm working with. I got shit all over the ground. Like, this the setup I'm working with. It's not major. <sighs>